money. The longer we're there, the more the money is to save. And that there are companies, there are positions over there that have been able to circumvent international law, the Uniform Code of Military Justice, for crimes that I'm not going to get into. If we can stop the privatization of our military, it's not going to solve everything. But our government is accountable to us. So, we can make things a lot better. And most of those troops would rather be here with us, the 99%, because they're not affluent. They are us. And we need to get them back so they can help us rebuild this mess that we're starting right here.